guys so the weather is changing right and usually when it starts getting colder outside you notice that sometimes there's bugs here and there right so i wanted to tell you to, i wanted to tell you about two different home remedies that i use um home remedies is that the word yeah home remedies right um that i use and one was uh one of my friends who used to do um he used to do like exterminating told me about one and then another one um i think i picked up from youtube so one of the home remedies is i'll demonstrate both to you um one of the home remedies is there's this stuff right um that you can get from home depot or whatever it's like seven bucks right and i had a really bad problem with german roaches like it was horrible i remember like they were like oh my god i couldn't go in my kitchen without them coming now i remember like no matter how much i clean it felt like they were still there i remember like i'm that's when i lived in an apartment you know and they always say that when you're next to people like you never know how clean they are and sometimes the bugs can come into you right so um anyways it was bad it was so bad so one of my friends he used to be an exterminator and he gave me this secret so before i continue i need you guys to like share and subscribe hit the notification bell and i'm gonna get into it in just a second another one i did find from a fellow youtuber on youtube and it has done great and it's chemical free you know what i mean um so i'm gonna go ahead and give y'all you know um the details so the one that my homeboy it's like this ant stuff it's for fire ants or whatever you know and it's like a powder i usually use it outside and my homeboy is saying that all you have to do is get it right and you're going to go around every single corner in your house right so you're going to you know kind of like i guess i'll demonstrate like in my rush my, not my restroom my laundry room i don't put it everywhere in my house now because i have free roam bunnies um, which I will be leaving um, a link uh, below for my daughter's video for her bunnies. Um, but anyways, so what you'll do is you're going to get the powder. You're going to go into the corners of your house, preferably where your pets and kids can't get there because it's like a powder, you know. And you're going to spray, you know, it takes about two days, right? If you have German roaches, you have a big problem. German roaches just is a big, huge problem. So if you have a big problem like germ, German roaches, I've used it and I love it. I will never, like if I ever see a bug again, like I'm going to pick that stuff up and start doing my corners in my house. So right now I kind of do the corners because I do have free roam bunnies. Um, but when I didn't have free roam bunny, I had my bunny like in a cage, like a big cage that it could kind of like play in, made a little house for it and stuff. I would do it all over the house. So I did it like on every single corner that he like he told me every corner of my house i did it when around the house all my rooms and within like three days it went away all the bugs no bugs y'all know how bad it is to get rid of german roaches like you have to spend an arm and a leg it takes forever no freaking german roaches okay so i'm gonna also have a picture of the product that i use then um okay so the only thing about it the only problem that i have with this thing this stuff is that when you use it there's a stench right it smells kind of like cabbage so your house will smell like cabbage for a couple of days you know but who doesn't want to get rid of german roaches right so i took it i didn't mind if my house smelled like cabbage i wanted the roaches gone it was too many of them I just, I couldn't, I couldn't stand it anymore. Like, they drove me insane. Oh, my God. Oh, that's another story for another time. But anyways, so, there's this other product as well that I use, right? It's Dawn Soap and Water. You get a spray bottle, you put Dawn Soap and Water, and when you see a German roach or any bug, any bug, it's it's worked on all types of bugs. I've seen wasps, I've seen spiders, I've seen, um, I've seen wasps, I've seen spiders, I've seen, um, shit centipedes crickets big bug big roaches small roaches whatever you know what i mean and i literally do not have a problem so when you see them this one does not work around the house like the other stuff so i recommend that this is something that you use like if it's just like you want to use something that's not toxic 
where you have kids and pets and stuff like that, like that roach spray that's like, ugh, you can't breathe. You want, If you want to use something that's not toxic, then you can do Dawn soap and water. You put like, if I were to guesstimate how much Dawn soap I put in, in it, I would say a little more than a teaspoon, maybe like about a full um, two teaspoons or three teaspoons. I use a generous amount because I want it to die on contact. So when I use it, I spray pss, pss, dead. Literally, give it a couple seconds. Like sometimes I'll wait for like a second and it'll die. But it's like not toxic. You know, it's Dawn soap. It makes your house smell not bad. And then, you know, like you can spray it around your kids or your pets and they're not gonna get sick or smell, in the, smell those fumes. So yeah, I'll take pictures of everything and then I'm going to go ahead and make a mini short video on it so that you can see these items hand, head, hand on. No, oh, sorry. Hands on, but they're great home remedies. Um, I would never even hire an exterminator at this point because when it comes to those freaking roaches, like it went away. It went away. Oh my God. Anyways, so like, share, and subscribe. And I'm going to show you everything and cook it up for you. And you can see how it works. Hey guys, this is my personal mixture. It's just Dawn soap and water. Nothing fancy. You see, I use like a generous amount. I just get a literally, this is a, I'm just going to dump it out so I can show you guys. This is a, was an empty bottle of whatever, spick and span that I used before to clean my house. And I use the whole bottle. You can just go buy a freaking spray bottle somewhere. And I put like a generous amount. I think this is about it. Kind of just, you know. I want it to be um, as generous as possible so that it can kill bugs on contact. You see? I put a generous amount as possible. It doesn't matter what my cold water. It's literally the simplest thing that you can do. And then I just kind of, this is it. This is literally what you need to kill a bug on contact, okay? Like, it could be a wasp, it could be a centipede, it could be a spider, I don't care. You know, you see? That's it. So what you do, you see a bug, right? bug you just kind of spray it well i spray it i'm not gonna lie like, you can spray it one time but because of how extra i am i spray it multiple times i go one two three and literally it will die literally and if it doesn't die right away just give it a couple moments that's why i say make sure it's a generous amount because i've noticed before if i don't put enough dawn soap in this mixture then it might take a couple more sprays than just the one. It might be like, <laughs> but it'll die. Trust me, it'll die. It kills their exoskeleton. Um, and it kills, so it pretty much kills them from the outside. Um, so when you have a little bug and you see it right there, this is what this is for. It's not to, to cure all bugs, but to cure that specific situation that you might have. This is the other product that I used that I was telling you guys about that killed the German roaches within a couple of days. So it's orthene kills ants, kills in minutes, right? So what you do, I'm just showing you what my laundry room, just to kind of give you an example, is I kind of just poked a hole in it, but I'm sure you, if you can get a smaller hole, please do so. And you're gonna kind of just dust it on the corner, the edges of your house, like, like so. You know, wherever you need it, in your problem areas, it's gonna smell a little like cabbage. I put, I'm putting this in like my laundry room because I do have free from room bunnies. Um, but if you don't have a bunny problem or, uh, you know, whatever, then you can just go ahead and put it all over your house, around the corners. <clears throat> It's gonna have a little stench to it, but they will die. I can promise you that. They will definitely die. Thank you so much guys for watching. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe and leave comments if you like 
videos like this leave comments i have a lot of home remedies to talk about because i'm really into home remedies and i love to try home remedies or if you know a home remedy that you want me to post online or try myself let me know and thank you so much for you guys this time